Hi, it's Mark the Land Rover, and I've, what I've done is I've taken the bikini hood off, and I'm going to go with a full canvas. I think the bikini, bikini hood was a bit, ah, it's a bit of a gimmick, really. I'm not happy with it uh, being aftermarket because the, the loops, the kind of catches in here snapped, the, the plastic catches in there snapped. So, so if anyone's got any hoops, I need the I need the centre hoop or the because I've got the front hoop, and I think they're the same for the canvas roof. So I need the centre hoop, I need the connecting bars which are about there, and then I need the rear hoop. So if anyone's got two hoops that they're willing to sell me, fantastic, that'd be brilliant. And then I've got the seat box to put on, seat box cover. This is by uh, Drew Wright at Wright Off Road. That's about a mile thick and about as heavy as well. <laughs> that's, so that should quieten it down a little bit. Not that I'm trying to quieten it down, but um, it'll make it look like it's finished. Because uh, at the moment, if I open the door, We've got a kind of scruffy seat box there. Got to just put put some paint on there, some de-ruster on there, give it a rub down, put some paint on, um, and then put the seat box cover on. Because all that's nice and, the rest of it's nice and uh, done. I need some tunnel covers on here, and I need the corner covers on there to put on. And then that's the interior done. So the interior's not looking too bad now, it's actually looking quite tidy. Oh, I've got the, uh, uh, I've got the door covers to put on the door. They're going to be canvas, black canvas door covers, or door, what they're called? Door liners? Not sure what they are now, anyway. The door bits with the little pockets in because they look pretty good. And then I'm going to paint the inside and paint the front because that's still black. And if anyone's got one of these, a, a little catch that goes on there, then I can connect my flaps up for winter. It doesn't matter too much in summer, but in winter, be nice to have the flaps closed. So I need a clip and rear hoop so I can put the canvas on. And now I've locked in the, the spare wheel. So I've locked my anti-loose down with a bolt. That, that's pretty solid. I've got to lock, I've re lock one of these nuts up just in case, when I mean, they haven't moved I don't think. In fact, that one might have moved, look. Right, I'll, I'll do a, I'll torque these back down again later and then lock wire them up so they don't move. Everything else is looking pretty good. I've got a new new handle to put on there because that's, that's kind of... Uh, I bashed into a recovery truck and that's bent the handle. So I've got a new handle to put on there. And then that's all for now. Squeaky fan belt still to do. I think I've got... I think the pulley's gone because I've tightened the fan belt and it's still squeaking on startup. So I think the pulley's gone. So that means a new pulley uh, on the end of wherever the end... wherever the pulley goes. All right, that's it. Mark out.